OK, I'm going to show you how to try and reduce the number of wire labels displayed on circuit diagram pages. By default, when you generate wire numbers using the wire number method, you will see that you get lots of wire numbers displayed all over the place. Effectively, every section of wire will receive a wire label. And we see that displayed on there. So, as an alternative, I'm going to clear all of those. Now this uh, applies to the standard and advanced versions of uh, V7R2. I'm going to right click on the circuit diagrams, go to the properties and go to the tab for wires. So that was right click circuit diagram properties and wires. And I'm going to switch from potential to signal numbering. That allows me to go into the signal type setup and I can choose to display in this case potentials. It's the important thing otherwise I won't see anything. Rather than have individual formats for these, I'm going to switch to global numbering and choose a format of just a sequential number starting from one and a step of one. Now, notice in this one, as you scroll across, there are lots of properties for each of these types of wires you can draw. And the one we're going to change in a minute is the minimum length. At the moment, it's 10 millimeters. So if I now click on OK and choose OK, we see a slightly different option here for numbering, which now is just uh, it says generate. We can generate on all signals, click on OK, and we see a very similar outcome. So what I'm going to do, right click, go to properties, into wires, signal type setup, and now I'm going to change this minimum length. I'm going to say that it has to be at least 100 millimeters before it puts a label on. And that will force the software to put just a single label on each one. You can see straight away that that's gone down just to a single label on each one of those wires.